How's it going, everybody? Welcome back to the channel. Um, today we're going to be doing we'll something be doing a little different. In depth and my as honest as I can review of the new GCX line of G Lumens. I've had this rod for around two months now, and the only reason I've waited this long to make a video is because I want to be able to really get my hands on it and fish it and find its strong points, its weak points, see what it was good at, what it wasn't so good at, and uh, mainly just find what it really excelled at was my main goal. And I really wanted to be able to be well versed and knowledgeable enough on the rod to be able to do a good review on it. So took the time, went out and fished with it for a little bit and uh, found out what I like to do with it, what I didn't like to do with it. And, mainly what the other reason why I wanted to go out and fish with it and the whole reason why I'm making this video is there's not really a lot out there as far as reviews of these new GCX the rods came to be is these are the replacement for the E6X they are oh. still doing the warranty on the ECX rod so that's how I got my hands on this I had a 7.5 medium E6X broke the tip on it sent it to them they asked me what rod out of the GCX series I'd like to replace it with. And so I picked the uh, the 852S jig worm rod. That's what this is, love this rod. Um, so we're so gonna do it. I've had around two months to play around with this rod now. Thrown a lot of different techniques, a lot of different bottom baits, moving baits, even threw a little top water popper on it just to mess around. Why not? And this rod definitely excels in bottom contact. What I have tied on now is a shaky head. This is just a 3 16 ounce shaky head. One of my favorite things to throw on this rod right here is this shaky head. Um, I love it, absolutely love it for a shaky head. It's a great Ned Rig rod. Um, not a very light Ned Rig rod. Uh, for a little bit for a heavier, I'd stay around 3 16 quarter ounce. Um, now you could throw an eighth ounce shaky head on this. I wouldn't really throw an eighth ounce Ned rig. Um, probably drop down to like a medium light. If you're not familiar with G Loomis's model numbers and all that, the 852S, this is a 7-1 medium extra fast action. Another thing I threw on this rod that I really, really like throwing on it is smaller just jig head swim baits exposed hook swim baits um 2.8 kitex 3.3 kitex um the easy shiner four inch on just a little 3 16 quarter ounce ball head jig love it phenomenal got a couple shaky head fish um it's great wacky rig cinco phenomenal it's a great cinco rod all around texas rig Shaky head Cinco, um, wacky it's rig. It's a good all around spinning rod. If you want one spinning rod that you can grab to go out and do majority of your spinning techniques, finesse techniques, this rod will do it. Do I think this rod is worth the $60 difference that they, you know, replaced? Cause the, you can't get the ECX anymore. The E6X, you can't get them anymore. There might be a few places that still have some left, but for the most part, they are discontinued. So if you want to get into G Luma, start throwing G Luma's rods, you're gonna pay $249. If you, pay, if you buy you new, you probably get E6Xs used, but if you want a new, this is what you're gonna, this is G Luma's entry level rod. And I do, I think it is worth the $60 difference. I I'm just gonna do. roll a few fish catches, let you guys see, you know, me catching something on it. And then we'll wrap up the like on the video, subscribe to the channel for future rod reviews I have in the making coming out and many more and many more like it and just many more videos in general. Backpack full of finesse type baits. And we're gonna just come out here and see if we can't get something done this morning. Starting off a little three inch swim bait, quarter ounce jig head, just a ball head, nothing crazy. Let's get started.
Okay. Just a little guy. Come up and got it right by the bank. A little swim bait. First fish on that new rod, baby. Wrong way, bud. There you go. There's one. Finally. Oh, came off. Got that little swim bait off. I rigged up a shaky head. This is just a um, quarter ounce stand up shaky head. On a, that's a net bait, seven inch T Mac. Got his butt that time. Oh, that's a decent one too. Oh no, he's a little guy. Come here, little buddy. Oh. Not a bad fish. It got that thing down there. Oh, look at him, he's got some lipstick. Yep, knew it. First cast. A little large mouth on that underspin. Look at that. I don't even have the camera on anymore. Wow. <laughs>